Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo, and today I have a Target Halloween clearance haul for you guys. Quick little impromptu bonus video of some things I found at 90% off at my Target. I'm starting with this, and it's the biggest, so we can get it out of the way. I'm so excited about this, you guys. It's one of their massive Halloween trays. It's got these beautiful handles for kind of like a brass. I love this tray. I liked it when I did the shop with me for you guys. Now, yes, it's Halloween, but guess what? I own sandpaper and paint, and I'm not afraid to use them. So I think it might stay black. It is big, 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 and it was $20 at 90% off, so I got it for $2. It might end up in my daughter's room because it's kind of black and she has a boho feel. There's a little black in there too. Who knows? It might end up in my living room for Christmas. So I'm going to sand off the part that says trick or treat and the pumpkins, repaint it black. And I have this massive tray for $2. Now, something I was very excited to find and it's not damaged is this super cute little black ceramic cat. And I have two open mouth or wide mouth candy dishes like this already. This one was originally $10, so I paid a whopping dollar for it. So now I have a set of three, and you guys know I love the black cats. Also, just quick side note, a lot of people who see um, stuff I post on Instagram, I'll go ahead and put my Instagram here for you if you're interested have asked how many totes it takes to pack away my Halloween stuff. Two. But now I may need a third. The tray will not become Halloween decor, but I do have a few larger things like a wreath that does not fit in a tote and a very large metal um, candle holder that's a big pumpkin. You guys can see that in my home tour. So I could fit him in a tote with some of these things. So to answer the question, two, but now possibly three. Okay, something else, definitely Halloween related, the trick or treat sign. I thought this was cute, but I didn't wanna pay $3 for it, just to be honest with you. And it has out of candy on this side, so I got this one for 30 cents. Sign me up. Something else that I liked, but I was not sold on are these metal haunted mansions because they're three dollars each and i'm sold on them for 30 cents that's the long and short end of it so they do have four sides and i considered getting four but this side is really short and so i think i'm of course everything looks better displayed in threes and odd numbers so i'll turn one this way one that way and one that way and they do hold a candle or whatever you want, but I'll put candles in these next Halloween. I lied, they were $5. That's why I was not drawn to them because I had thought they were gonna be $3, but they were five each, so I paid 50 cents. So for $1.50, I have some haunted mansion candle holders or lanterns. Another great thing that I was super excited to find and yes, I made some from the Dollar Tree, but I think these are really, really cute. Are the little witch's legs, and these are three-dimensional, so they're not the flat, stick-out kind. Um, these were actually back in the main portion of their Halloween decor, which was the hide and eek. And this is a $10 item I paid a dollar for, so I just like the shape of her legs. So this will go into a bin that I purchased Something also Halloween related that I purchased two of are the little spooky black glitter trees. It's another thing that I just, this one was a $5 item. I didn't want to pay $5, but for 50 cents, yes, I will purchase these and use them next year. So I picked the two best that I could find. Now I think everything else is fall related I got 
a couple sets of the starry lights that they put out for fall these have the little glass balls on them and they had some with the clear bulbs or balls and then the others had green these are all the clear so these are a three dollar item so i got a bunch at 30 cents well i got three i got three sets so excellent price something else i got sing potential so i don't love these i didn't like them when they put them out and you guys know i have a ton of real succulents but these are originally three dollars so for 30 cents i got all this greenery because you can just pull these out they're just picks so I did buy two. I could only find two. If I could have found more, I probably would have bought more. And now the garlands. So these were a $5 item and they're just very, I think winter. They are boxwood with like some frosted looking snow on them. $5, so 50 cents. I picked up three. So for $1.50, I got three of these. You can tell I just love the hunt. I love the hunt and I love a good price. Um, something I paid regular price for at my dollar spot that I've never seen there before is this cute little pumpkin pie. It's a little $1 stand. So I thought that was super cute. I am transitioning the hutch out for Thanksgiving. And then I also got my last item. You guys saw these. I shared these with you guys for fall in a shop with me. Hopefully that's not blinding you. Um, it's getting darker earlier, so I was trying to hop on real quick um, while we had any kind of lighting to share these things with you. So you can get to your Target and hopefully find a few good deals. These were out for the beginning of football season they say game day on them. Game day and mimosas. Now they're galvanized large buckets. They were a $5 item. So I got these each for 50 cents. Look at the handles alone on these. So run, don't walk, or at least if you're in Target, check out the back of the store. I know that a lot of you guys say that your store doesn't have these things. I guarantee you it's hit or miss. I have also shared on Instagram what my Bullseyes Playgrounds look like other than one or two stores in my area. So just check. It doesn't hurt to walk to the back of the store, get a few steps in and see if they have anything good on clearance. My store went 90% today. So I hope you guys are able to find some treasures out there. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you back very soon in the next one.